Hey y'all, it's another cold morning out here. I think it's like 22 or something like that. I don't know if you're up north and in the snow, it might not be sounding that cold, but for here it feels very cold. Uh, I got out here early this morning. I'm trying to work on this fence line. Uh, I had stuff all over it uh, in that rain we got last week all this low area here just flooded and it just takes the debris wraps around the wire and just pushes it and this whole line is down and the sheep got into here yesterday and then they were out in this field so getting this fence fixed up today and hopefully we won't have that problem again Got all this back up. Out of the weeds. Put it up down here yet. But my wife just called and said she's making breakfast. Some sourdough pancakes and cinnamon rolls. So I'll be stopping for a minute. Well, I'm back from eating my breakfast and uh, just put some concrete around this post here. I had dug the hole and had the post in it and never concreted it and it just got really loose. So I put some concrete in it. This is where that water came th through here. And it actually picked up this pivot tire from over here where they took it down and uh, I guess it floated over here and it actually hit the fence there a little bit and you can see all this debris was floating in the water and just uh, stopped right here. They're all up there eating some fresh grass. I got the trailer hooked up and I'm gonna run into town. Gotta get some gas for the four wheeler and uh, I need to pick up some panels to start building this corral uh, and some T-posts and stuff. So that's the next thing on the agenda for today. Uh, I got me some cattle panels and T-posts and uh, I have my sheep tractor out here and so I'm gonna do my best to construct some sort of corral out here. Uh, I'm not sure exactly how it's all going to go yet, but I need to get something up that uh, I can start catching some of these animals and just a couple out here I need to sell and I think I'm going to take the four cows and haul them over to the other pasture, so we'll see. I'll probably, this will probably be a project that I work at this afternoon is starting to work at this corral. So I'm over here at David's and we're going to get a little alleyway set up right here uh, and get the cows uh, inside a little wire area here and then we're going to be hauling six cows and two calves over to the other farm where I got some hay bales that are open and they'll be eating on that for the next few weeks. I like it. <laughs> and this is Mr. Perfectionist David here, and he's building this fence. 
the jumper wires between each strand of wire are crimped on. I'm too lazy, I just simply wrap the wire around, but old David here, he does it right. <laughs> That's funny. Got the two calves, that was the most important part. <laughs> yes sir, David. I started on this corral laying it out I'm excited to get done so I can see how it looks because right now I have no clue what that's gonna look like <laughs> uh, I got six of those panels and I put them up kind of in a U shape and then the sheep tractor has wheels under it so it is portable but I think I'm gonna uh, put it across the end there and I, don't, I might have to get some more panels um, yeah just not quite sure how it's gonna look when it's all done, but at least trying to get started here and get a little bit of a structure to be able to put them in. Well, it's starting to take shape. Uh, got two panels on each side here, over there, then over there. Then I have this thing positioned here at the end. Put a post in that corner to hold it solid. And they can get in over there. I think I'm probably gonna have to make it a little bit bigger. I might have to add some on that way or something, but it's at least a start, kind of uh, start feeding them in here and see um, how it works with them, how many it holds, and you know, we'll just keep working at it from here. Papa and Daddy wants to take a picture of it. What do you think? Cool. This is our new baby lamb. Its name is Curly. We finished out the day finding that orphan ram. Uh, David and I were out looking at the sheep and we saw it. And so I kept an eye on it. It didn't seem like there was any moms claiming it. So we brought it back here to, uh, I guess, raise it. Now I'm getting the grill fired up and gonna do some steaks and pork chops to end off the day should be good thanks for tuning in we'll see y'all next time